it is right now you need forgiveness for? Or who is it that you need to forgive today so that you can have the peace back in your life? These are the things we prayed over all week. That God would forgive us of our sins as we forgive those who sinned against us.
one of two ordinances that Jesus commanded us as his followers to celebrate to remember him. The other one is baptism. We used unleavened bread and juice, but it's not about the physical bread and juice. It's about the body and blood of Jesus. It's about listening to Jesus and doing what he says. Communion is not an obligation, it's a celebration. Communion celebrates Jesus. Communion marks how he gave his life to give us a better life and a fresh relationship with God. It's not about ritual, it's about relationship, about the person of Jesus. Jesus wants us to remember every time that we take the bread and juice that he is the one that provides us with all we need. He gives us the physical food we need to survive and the spiritual nourishment that we need to keep taking the next, next steps with him. So if you are a follower of Jesus Christ, I invite you to take part in the celebration of communion with us. The way we do it here is we have you come forward, get your elements, and go back to your seat. And then we ask you just to take a moment until everyone has been seated. We just have some quiet time with God. Just spend that little bit of time with Him. So I ask you now to just go ahead and get up, and there are three different places that you can come. Back to your seats. Just reflect on what he's done for you.